Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Armin's High Life. It's evening time now, Thursday. We had a really busy day. We had a couple cords going out uh, worth of wood. We're pretty much right sold out of split wood right now. Here was our pile that we did have. It's pretty much right sold down. We got a couple just broken chunks and just our bunch of kindling we gotta deal with. We still got that one pile from last time. We still have to split that up. And we still got our little mountain of our shorter chunks that we haul in with the truck. We could roughly have about, I'm gonna say about six, maybe seven cords there worth of wood, maybe. Six for sure though. But uh, today we're gonna be doing a different uh, video. We've been uh, getting a lot of views on our one unboxing on our Honda motor. So today we're gonna do a bit of a review on it. We were gonna do a video on a, putting on our one piece here onto our conveyor i thought it just mounted up right onto here but apparently it don't so we gotta take this whole black piece out and uh remove that we got all the bolts out except this one just uh the allen key on the other side is right stripped out so we're gonna have to cut that guy off we were gonna do that this evening, but we went back to the shed there and we noticed that we don't have any cutoff wheels. So we're gonna have to go to town tomorrow, pick some up for that. But we're gonna get that on eventually here. Well, we can't really do much more business without it on. So we gotta get that done tomorrow for sure. But we're gonna get on to our review here. We got the Honda GX390. It's a 13, I think 13 and a half horsepower motor. We've had it for five months now, and it works really good. It's never uh, gave us any troubles in the morning time or whatnot. We have only ran it through the summer here so far. Our coldest morning has probably been a uh, plus five uh, Celsius. Uh, we went through about four oil changes so far on it. We worked it out through the five months. It works out to about 280 hours so far we put on this motor. And she fires up just like a dream still, so we'll just show you guys. Get you set up here. Get you put on the jerry can. All right. So still original setup. Just put it on. Put the choke. Get the horsepower ready for your water. Start pull still. As you guys can see, it's the first pull. We haven't ran it all day. Well, we did run it a little bit this morning, but that was at least 10 hours ago, roughly. But she does pretty good. We're gonna uh, take a quick peek here. Better on filter. See how dusty it gets in there. It's not too bad. Here's our filter. As you guys can see, she does collect a bit of dust, but inside, it's still pretty clean. So it's got a good filter, not too much stuff in there. We're gonna have to definitely get that cleaned out though. I have not touched that one so far. So that's actually the first time I've gone in there. What wrong way? If we can get this back on, here we go. So that's pretty sealed up there right there. And she does get really dusty as you guys can see how dirty the motor is. Sometimes this thing gets pretty coated up with the sawdust. We try to keep it away from the motor as much as possible, but nothing. Our one pull, our one uh, chunk of rubber is still holding up. All of our bolts are holding on there nicely. The last motor that we did have on here, they only had uh, these little rubber spacers to just go underneath each side, which they, uh, after the machine's vibrating so much, they just fall off. Maybe it's the motor, it doesn't vibrate as much, but these ones are holding on so far nicely. We put through quite a few cords with it. I'm not even, I'm not even too sure how many. There's been quite a few that have gone through here so far. But it's an awesome motor so far at five months. We've had her 
We'll probably be doing another uh, review on it once we hit probably a year. Keep you guys updated. But we're going to probably wrap that up for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Uh, also, Alan, we did our video here today on a 16.9. Uh, we got that at least on our camera. We're going to try to uh, make sure it stays on that through the in-shot and then put it onto YouTube. Still trying to figure this out, but we're going to get it. Hopefully you guys are having a good week and staying busy. Uh, next video will be Saturday. We're going to be doing a bunch of canning on that video. So hopefully you guys enjoy that. Possibly learn something new, but we'll talk to you guys next time. Have a good night. Armin's High Life.